Um, the Wave has the Hulk World War II Captain America, which is the variant, which I don't have because it looks pretty ridiculous, as you can see. Nick Fury, Captain America, Iron Man, Thor, Shield Agent. So first up, we have the figure that I wanted the most in this wave. Nick Fury. Nick Fury was obviously given a very large change from his comic book. His look in the comic books, where he was um, Caucasian. And now he's Samuel L. Jackson. He's got his very recognizable leather jacket. His eye patch. Um, he's got... Just like the Punisher. He's got a gun and a holster. Not much else to say really about this. Except maybe if you want uh, Nick Fury for your... To go along with your your Iron Man movie, Iron Man, probably get this. So now we have the first member of the Avengers, Thor. This is also my first Thor mini mate, and it's actually my only Thor mini mate. The only thing I don't like about this figure's face is that the the beard. An eyebrow color is different from the hair color. It just looks a little odd. The hair is very cool. It's very unique. He's wearing his Ultimates costume, obviously. Why wouldn't he be? Um, if you take this off, you'll get just a shirtless Thor. They actually detailed like his stomach and his abs and stuff. I'm not going to do it because I don't want to. Um, his accessory is obviously Melnior. Why would you have a Thor without it? It's very good. Here's the pack that I was the least excited about. The Captain America and Shield Agent. So here's the Shield Agent wearing camo and a... a helmet with a thing there. Uh, you could probably just buy like a couple packs of this and maybe get like your own little army. Um, pretty detailed. It's got shield logo, pouch. Um, what I do like about this is that they actually detailed this on his head so that if you take off the helmet it doesn't just look bland. Now here is the worst figure in the set, Captain America. And the only reason that this figure is terrible is because of the face. Now if you could see here, that's a pretty good face. But when you put the mask on, whoops, where does eyes go? You can barely see them. So you have to kind of position the mask up a little so that you could see the eyes and even that like if you do anything it'll just fall off so probably if you're gonna have this figure maybe don't display him with his mask on and display him uh, with his hair piece Costume obviously looks really good. Not as good as the Invaders one. It's got a shield. Nothing we haven't seen before. Now we got the pack most people probably get. Iron Man, Hulk. So we've got the Hulk. First off I want to say his pants look kind of weird. Because the battle damage just looks kind of sloppy. Um, he's got these weird boxing glove hands, which I do not like. Thankfully, he came with regular hands to swap out. 
Kind of like the duck feet. Which, by the way, this figure came with, but I tossed. I threw them out. As soon as I saw that they were duck feet, I just threw them out. This looks pretty good. Nice veins. and face looks very scary. Now, like in the comics, he's got this weird, weird hair. Very different from the other Hulks we've got. He looks actually a bit more like the movie Abomination than actually the Hulk. But that's not really a bad thing. At least he's wearing pants. Now the weird thing about this is that if you take his head off and you take... Well, yeah, this is weird too. This is something that I've never seen before on a mini mate. I have no clue what it's for. Um, if you take his chest piece off and that cylindric thing, and I guess if you put the other hands on him, you get kind of a smaller Hulk, which doesn't really make much sense to me. Alright, so now we have Ultimate Iron Man, the best figure in the set. Um, obviously, he's wearing his very awesome Ultimates costume. Very detailed. He has this weird little flap here. I have no idea what it's for. But that just goes back up. His helmet is nice because it doesn't have the thing that comes off, like the Iron Man movie. That was the only thing I didn't like about that wave. Very nice face. Um, take this off. Put that on. And you've got Tony Stark with all the gooiness. Like in the comics. That's how he put the suit on. Very nice Tony Stark face. I would say this set was, this wave was a little bit disappointing for me just because I had such high hopes. Um, I would recommend if, you know, you not get um, these two because they're just, um, this set's not good at all. It's, the Captain America is stupid. And the shield agent is just unnecessary. This one I obviously will recommend picking up, but not if you have the Iron Man movie or the Hulk movie mini mates because these are just not as good. I will recommend that you pick this one up, definitely. The Thor is the best Thor I've seen. And Nick Fury is just, just awesome. And obviously the uh, variant just looks silly.